Hey, what's going on everybody? My name is Alice, and I hope you all are having a wonderful day. Today, I'm going to be doing another DLC pre not prediction, my bad. Another DLC speculation for Star Wars Battlefront 2. This is going to be the last video of these types for a long, long while. Okay, so hope you guys enjoyed this last episode of DLC speculation. But today's DLC speculation, the last one, will be about Coruscant. Yes, Coruscant. The most wanted planet and map in the entire Biofront 2 universe. Many people want it for different reasons and different maps as well. So let's get to it. To so say that I'm feeling a lot better today. I don't know why, but I mean, I'm not complaining, so um, I'm doing it. Okay, so. For this DLC season, I want to see that Senate Chamber for a map for Coruscant because, I mean, people just want it. Over at my account's Facebook page, people are saying, hey, we want the Senate Chamber. We really think it's an amazing place and it could be interesting for Battlefront 2. And... I agree with them, even though <coughs> I don't want to see it that much. I mean, if people want it, then let's get it for them. I don't want it, but people want it. Okay, let's do it. And another map for Coruscant that we will all love to see, including me, including you, including everybody. That map is the one and only. Jedi Temple The Jedi Temple. Oh my gosh, it has so many possibilities But number one, I mean It looks awesome. Okay, it's a temple. I always love temples. I honestly really like temples number two That's where Order 66 Happened well not for the first time, but I mean they kill a lot of Jedi, Knights, Padawans, Masters, they kill tons of Jedi. There's a reason why the 500 first are very popular. Man, it's incredible. Well, no, I mean, sad. So, people would love to see on the Jedi Temple because... In the future, they could possibly add a Order 66 game mode to the game. I mean, imagine that playing it, a Order 66 game, 66 game mode, and Battlefront 2. Um, <laughs> Jedi versus Clone Troopers. Amazing. I mean, this map could also add a pretty unique. Reinforcement as well. That being the Temple Guards. I mean, it was obvious. I mean, who doesn't want to see Temple Guards? I certainly do. They have a double bladed lightsaber. Number one, they look amazing, okay? <laughs> um, and the dual winning lightsabers which are color yellow I mean yellow is pretty awesome I don't think we have anybody with a yellow lightsaber yet especially double blade yellow lightsaber so they could uh, lightsaber wielding characters a bit of a challenge because they could go against them Using the lightsabers as well. You can basically neutralize them. Neutralize the threat. The lightsaber threat. The standard form that I would like them to be would be um, um, the Clone Wars. So that's how I want them 
to look like as their regular selves from the Clone Wars and maybe possibly you could have a skin for them where they're from the uh, Rebels TV show season 2 I believe it was that season where it was pretty badass moment it was like one of the last episodes of season 2 astonishing now on the senate chamber I forgot to mention and reinforcement that could come with the Senate chamber could be the Imperial Royal Guards. Yep. In the movie Revenge of the Sith, we did saw them. <coughs> we did saw them. Um, making company to Darth Sidious in the Senate chamber, so it will only be fitting. Having them as a reinforcement in the Senate chamber because we still don't have them in Battlefront 2. Many people would love to see them, including me, because in Battlefront 1, many people love playing as them. So, many people think that they could be badass and a pretty cool character. To have in that game. Many people suggest that they should be a enforcer as well. I uh, no. I think it will actually be fitting for them. So. Let me know your opinions. Comment section below. Same for the. In, why am I saying? Same for the temple guards. Many people would also like to see them. Because. They have like. Because it will give people a chance to play with a lightsaber wielders without actually playing as a hero. Because um, really good people will, will always choose the lightsaber users. So people who are not good at this game will never choose like a lightsaber wielder. So lightsaber wielder hero. So they could just choose to be a reinforcement that doesn't cost that much battle points and use a lightsaber that's going to give the beginners or rookies shinies a opportunity to play as a lightsaber wielder so those are the reinforcements those are the maps now Let's move on to the actual heroes. My gosh. I haven't even talked about the heroes. Okay. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. Number one hero is Anakin Skywalker. He is in this list because I chose him to be in this list, obviously, but I mean. Before you see anything, Anakin cannot be in this game because, oh, uh, Darth Vader is already in the game, oh, and Darth Vader is way cooler, oh, and Darth Vader will beat him, oh, and Darth Vader is in the game. Oh, just by the way, I just wanted to remind you that Darth Vader is in the game. Okay, yes, guys, I get it. Darth Vader is in the game, but Dennis Bramble over at Dice has teased Anakin to be in the game. I mean, on Twitter, he tweeted out a photo of Anakin with the 501st walking in the Jedi Temple. I mean, why would he choose Anakin instead of all people? Also, later on, well, before that, he said that just because one character is in the game doesn't prevent another character from being in the game. He never said Anakin, but I mean, it sure does sound like Anakin because one character will not prevent another to be in the game. So Darth Vader will not prevent Anakin Skywalker from being in the game. That's what I get from it. I don't know what you guys get from it. Um, He also does like Anakin Skywalker, I believe. Um, 
and obviously Anakin Skywalker is the main character, main character of the prequels. Why is he the main character of the prequels in the game? He's the main character. Like, he should be in the game already. Many people love Anakin, okay? Many people want Anakin to be a skin for Darth Vader. Which I can totally get. I mean, he was called Darth Vader when he went to the giant temple, so he could just have a hoodie. A hood, and that's all. So, I do get it, but I mean, Anakin is not Darth Vader. When somebody dies, they essentially erase the past and the name. So, they're two different characters from two different eras. And this game, in this game, you can play all eras at the same time. So, yeah, guys. Anakin Skywalker has some great possibilities of being in this game. I mean, he has a blue lightsaber, so he will obviously be in the light side. He would be a different character, so I mean, he would also get different abilities than Darth Vader. Obviously, I don't think he should throw his lightsaber. I think he should have an ability where he takes less damage from light. From blasters, bolts, something like that. He should either have force pull or force push. I think pull fits him more. Let me remind you guys that Anakin was also leaked to be in a DLC season as well. He was leaked to be a hero for DLC, so. Just saying, guys, Anakin, possible. He's so important throughout that Star, War Star Wars The Clone Wars TV show. So, just saying, guys, why isn't he winning the game? Like, what? Okay, so, the antagonist, aka enemy, aka villain, aka Arch enemy, aka rival, villain, should be Count Dooku. Because Count Dooku is a must have. Okay? I mean, Count Dooku cut Anakin's arm. Pre enforcing it? Well, he should be, he killed a ton of so Jedi. But the main reason why he should be in the game be, is he appeared in the movies. That's a big, very, very big reason. And our reason that he should be in this game is because everybody loves him. Not everybody, but many people loves him, okay? Many people loves him. I mean, his light chip is also pretty cool. Like, his curved, curved lightsaber is, is so different, unique. He just a must have villain for this game. He's just a must have. Okay, guys? Must have, okay? Don't judge me. Don't even <laughs> dare to comment something about Kantuku because he's a must have and you know that. Moving on, skins that I would love to see for these characters, okay? One skin for Count Dooku that I would like would be with his keep on. Well, actually, I would love to see Count Dooku with his cape as his standard form. And the skin for him should be without his cape. Okay, get it guys? Confusing? I don't know. Let's move on to Anakin. Anakin. His standard look should be from Revenge of the Sith without the hood. And his skin for him should be with the hood. And, I, and yellow eyes. Another skin that could fit Anakin will be like a younger self. A younger Anakin from episode 2. 
I believe it was episode 2. Those are skins. Let me know what skins do you want. But let's move on to the Starfires. We need Count Dooku's Solar Starfighter in this game. Like, it's so unique. We don't see it anymore. Everybody loved it. Okay, like, it was so cool. Like, very cool. Different from the other Starfighters in the game, so it's a must have. Anakin Starfighter should be a hero as well because it's it's <laughs> it's amazing. I mean the color yellow is amazing. We also saw in the movie so it's only fitting to have it because it was in a movie so okay. Another thing you should know about Kanduku and Anakin is that they were leaked to be Together in the DLC season, Anakin and Count Dooku were leaked to come together in the DLC season on um, Planet Mustafar, which sounds pretty awesome. Honestly, Mustafar is a which is a pretty awesome planet with lava all around it. If this comes true, then I would like to see a map where we can go inside Darth Vader's temple or palace yeah I would like to see Darth Vader's palace and most of all where Anakin or Darth Vader went and killed all the uh, separatist leaders that moment was quite sad to be honest seeing them all die if any DLC season that we got today Carissa or Mustafar, if any of those two comes true, I myself would be very happy. Not only that, but I'm sure uh, I'm sure that a lot of you guys will be really happy as well. And and if you enjoy, make sure to leave a comment, like this video, subscribe for you, and enjoy my content. Okay? And like this video for the hype of Anakin, Count Dooku, Mustafar, Coruscant, Jedi Temple, Temple Guards, Royal Imperial Guards. If you like any of those, leave a like on this video. I'll see you guys later, guys. This has been Unleashed. And I'll see you in the next one. Later, guys. Peace out. No, 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 no. Stop right there, stop it, don't, don't do it, don't click off the video yet, as always, you know me, I always forget something at the very end, that is, Dooku's ability, so, I think Dooku should have the ability to use some force, force lightning, just like Palpatine. So that's one ability that I suggest him having in the game if it does come out. Now, moving on. For Mustafar, uh, that enemy when you're fighting as a soldier should be the droids. Because we did saw them fight Anakin and Mustafar in Revenge of the Sith. Also, a skin that for the clone troopers that should have for most of our should be the shark troopers aka Coruscant guards whatever you want to call them shark troopers should be a skin for them because we saw them in most of our we saw them in most of our picking up Anakin and all that now for the temple, you know, for the Jedi Temple, <laughs> we should have the 501st skin for the clone troopers, obviously. <coughs> now, the third thing that I'm going to be talking about is very important. Palpatine, Darth Sidious, should he have a lightsaber? I say... 
I would allow him to have a light server for this game instead of force lightning. I mean, the force lightning does make him a unique character. And by Frampa, I would still love to see him have a light server, so. Even better. In the TV show, he did use two dark. Oh my gosh. He did use two light servers, so. You know. So, I think Poppin' Thing should come with two lightsabers. He did use the lightsaber in the movie, so it really makes fitting. In the TV show, he used two lightsabers, so even better. Do with lightsabers. That's all I wanted to say. Enjoy the rest of the video. Bye, guys. This time for good. Oh my god, this video is so long. Hope you enjoyed the rest of the video because <coughs> it's so long. I don't know if you guys are even watching it anymore. <sighs> if you're still watching this video at this time, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. I'll see you tomorrow. That's even if I can't record tomorrow because I'm so tired right now. I don't know if I'll make another video today for tomorrow. Oh, uh,